Buenos dias, good morning from Madrid, Spain. My name is Christina Gardner. I'm 26 years old, originally from Fresno, California. I've lived in Madrid for the past four school years, and I'm so excited to take you along in a day in my life. I am on my way to work. I live in the city center, but I work in a tiny little pueblo about 45 minutes outside the center. The doors on the bus go open and shut, open and shut, open and shut. Good job! Hello, good morning! I found my job after completing the online ITA program in 2020. With the help of their lifetime job assistance, they connected me with programs here in Madrid that have jobs for native language teachers and I did the interview process at home in California. Then after I got accepted, I was able to apply for my visa from the San Francisco consulate and get my visa, Spanish visa before I moved here in September of 2021. I'm here on a student visa where I'm contracted to work 25 hours a week and I have to renew the visa every single school year. Because I did my visa during COVID, my process was completely online. But I know that that depends on the consulate, so check in with your consulate to see if you can do it online or in person. That completely depends on the program. So for me in Escuela Excelente, where I work, you had to have a degree. Same with Up International, but I believe with NALCAP and USATAM, you do not have to have a degree. You can have a TEFL certification or have some early childhood education credits. Hello, time for a little apartment tour. Here is my bedroom. I have a big double-sized bed, nice closet. My beautiful baby girl, Hazy girl. Here I have the bathroom. It's very, very old. I don't think it has been redone since this uh, house was built in the 1800s. And here is the living room. We have the kitchen in there. And my absolute favorite, favorite part is this beautiful terrace where me and my friend Diego are having our afternoon merienda with these gorgeous, gorgeous views. Yes, I am a master's candidate at the University of San Diego. I will graduate in May with a master's of education in curriculum and development. I personally do not have any experience working with NELCAP, but I have a lot of friends who do. And I would say this is one of the best programs to get into. And if you can, you only work 16 hours a week. You always have either Monday or Friday off and you get paid about a thousand euros. Now this is a very difficult question. I think it's such a personal opinion. The best way that I can describe the both is Madrid has a little bit more of a New York vibe while Barcelona reminds me a lot of San Francisco. The Opera concert has just finished. I'm here with another ITA alumni, Ashley, and Hi. we are headed home. And just like that, my day is over. Thank you so much for following along with me. If you have any questions, feel free to follow my personal Instagram below. 
and I'll answer any questions you have. And then the link in my bio, you can access a free TEFL textbook. Good night.